Hey, it's me, JV, and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's 100% Fallout New Vegas. We're going to start this quest. We're going to start this episode off right. We're going to go to... One eighty-eight trading posts. We're gonna go get Veronica back. What's her name? Oh boy, is it Veronica? I made a complex in my mind now where I don't remember her actual name. We're gonna find out in two seconds though. One Mississippi, two Mississippi. Yeah, Veronica. What the hell was I saying? What other V? I know there's another V name that I was calling her the whole time, but I don't remember. Uh, v Vanessa? No. Was I calling her? Who cares? What's up? I think we should travel together. Let's go make trouble. Let's do it. Goodbye. Now, I got a hot tip. Oh, it was so hot. Uh, to go to Camp McCarran and maybe try to trigger her dialogue in a different way than what I was doing. So, uh, one of that, the way was basically uh, that she can take some time to catch up to you. She's supposed to trigger a line of dialogue here. So, if we walk in this door and wait for a little bit, we're going to see if she actually says anything. I'm going to get up and stretch a little bit because I'm sitting uncomfortably. Um, I don't think it's these doors. I think it's, uh, it's the other doors. Like, I think we have to <clears throat> actually get into, uh, the, the main area of Camp McCarran itself. But we're gonna sit here a second and see if she does anything. And as usual, uh, Veronica's doing what she does best, which is nothing. So we're gonna walk through these big double doors up here and see if this triggers her, her uh, quest, her, her dialogue stuff. For whatever reason, she is just really not wanting to do it. Uh, also, apparently with the Hildern dialogue, um, we were supposed to trigger her stuff uh, when he says, like, greetings for the first time. So since we already talked to him, it sounds like we're not going to get that trigger ever. But there are multiple triggers, so we should be fine. But uh, I just want to see. I want to see if this works. So we're going to enter these doors here. And we are literally not going to move. Is she in here with us? She is. Actually, we're going to move a little bit. We're going to move like that. And we're going to see. We're going to sit here and see. Because somebody said that, yeah, when they walk through these double doors, she eventually did do it. But it took a while. So we're going to see if that happens. I would love it, but I have to, you know, I have to say, I don't think it is going to happen. I think she's just either bugged or just typical Fallout, Elder Scrolls, Bethesda stuff where they're just not going to do anything. So we're going to wait 30 seconds and see if she ever comes up to me and talks to me. This Camp McCarran is supposed to be a trigger. Camp McCarran itself is supposed to be a trigger. And then Thomas Hildern over there is also supposed to be a trigger. Uh, but yeah, neither of which are activating. And it looks like Veronica is going to treat me the same way she did previously and do absolutely nothing at all. Come on, Veronica. You know you want to do it. She's supposed to talk to us, by the way, not the other way around. And nothing. It's been 30 seconds, right? Maybe walk around a little bit. Maybe, maybe have her move a step. Okay, what do you think? Come on unbelievable all right whatever so we're gonna move on now we'll take her with us for a while but uh yeah this is really annoying uh what we're gonna do now we're gonna clean up the bitter springs quests you know why because bitter springs i don't even know where it is by the way i don't remember where we actually went for bitter springs it's gotta be one of these things we haven't been haven't been in too many places oh man where the hell is bitter springs I literally just don't even know, like, at all. There it is. Okay. Thought it was on the outlier. Um, so, yeah, there are three quests in Bitter Springs. And we want to do them now because apparently there's a lot of other quests that will mess them up. And, in fact, we already might have messed one up. We'll just have to see. Uh, again, you know, this, this, is, this entire game is just a never-ending nightmare for trying 100%. Um, so, I'm trying to do it in the best way possible. But I don't, we haven't failed a quest yet. I'm sure it's going to happen at some point just because you have no idea, unless you've researched it, how many quests, like, go directly up against each other. Not even just the main quest. Everybody knows about that. But everything else, just how many, like, will make others fail and stuff. So we're looking for important people. And they're probably in the important-sounding tents. Such as these over here. So... Hey. No. No. Are they just literally going to be gone? That would really be awful. Um, hey. Yeah, hi. I'm looking for important people, man. You are... You, sorry, you don't fit the bill. Uh, let's see. We have somebody in here. There we go. Captain Giles. That's who I was looking for. I've been sending requests for relief for months now. Didn't think they'd send you, though. Why is the flag upside down? It's a distress call. 
This camp is in bad shape, and if we don't get relief soon, I don't know what will happen. What can I do to help? At this point, I'll take anything you can give me. We need more troops, fresh supplies, and medical relief. As if that wasn't enough, someone's been coming out of the mountains at night, stealing supplies and picking off my people. Where would you get new troops from? I don't know. The NCR's stretched thin as it is. I've put in requests at Camp Golf, Forlorn Hope, McCarran, but things are no better there. Maybe if their situations improved, they'd have men to spare. Or maybe they'd listen to someone with a reputation for helping the NCR. Huh, who could that be? What kind of supplies? Food, blankets, clothes, tools. The army used to ship out caches of supplies regularly. But with the Legion so active, we haven't gotten any in months. How can I help with medical supplies? You'll want to talk to Lieutenant Markland about that. He's our medical officer. He should be down at the medical tent now. What's this about someone killing refugees? It started about six months ago. At first it was just supplies going missing. We figured it was refugees. Then people started dying. Always a single bullet to the head. Always from extreme range. We've lost eight refugees and three soldiers to this son of a bitch. We know he must be hiding out in one of the caves up in the mountains. But I don't have enough men to send out looking for him. I'd like to ask about something else. Okay, but make it quick. I'm very busy here. Goodbye. Good luck. Goodbye. Okay, so there we go. We got two quests there. And there's another quest, though. Uh, and yeah, it was from, I think, that guy, Lieutenant Marklin. So let's try to find him first of all. And I think it's this gentleman right over here. Wow. Hey, it's you. What are you doing in Bitter Springs? Enjoying the scenery. Captain Guile said to talk to you about medical aid for the camp. Hey, if you can help, I'll take whatever I can get. The doctor's bags would be a huge help, but what I really need are medical texts. I'm not trained to deal with major psychological trauma, and we've got a lot of kids in this camp. Medical texts? Aren't you a doctor? I'm an army field medic. I can treat bullet wounds, shrapnel, trench foot, no problem. But this, the kids and the psychological trauma and all the rest, is out of my league. Any idea where I may find those books? Caravan companies are probably your best bet. Smaller traders aren't likely to have anything that esoteric. I'll keep my eyes open for the books on pediatrics or psychological trauma then. Thank you. Any help you can give would be a godsend. Okay, so we can give him some doctor bags. Uh, we can give him up to three, it looks like. Yeah, sure. Give three doctor bags. I brought you these doctor bags. I hope they help. Thank you. This will keep us well stocked for a good long while. Goodbye. Stay safe out there. All right, so there was a little uh, in the master file. There was some issue about doing these quests before. I forgot to remember to forget Boone's final quest, but looks like we got all three, so we'll be able to complete them. No problem. So the question is, which one do we do first? Let's see. Bitter Springs Infirmary Blues. Find a book on pediatric medicine for Lieutenant Marklin. Find Lieutenant Marklin a book on psychological treatment. Climb every mountain. Find the source of the attacks on Bitter Springs. No, not much. Talk about... Talk to Camp Forlorn Hope about reassigning soldiers to Bitter Springs. Talk to Camp McCarran about reassigning soldiers to Bitter Springs. Talk to Camp Golf about reassigning soldiers to Bitter Springs. Find supplies for the camp. Uh, that sounds boring. We're going to do this one. Climb every mountain. Find the source of the attacks on Bitter Springs. And it looks like we can just go right up here. Uh, I'm very curious as to what's going to happen with this one because I don't remember. As usual. Uh, yeah, I, I, I have no memory of this. I don't even remember the last time I've been to Bitter Springs. So, yeah, lots of these, I, as I keep saying, I only have done once, I think. Uh, that looks in... What the hell is that? Oh. Enter Great Con Supply Cave. Well, yeah. Uh, that is gonna be a lot... Of, oh, oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Yeah, didn't want to fight anything. I don't think they're gonna come out, are they? All right, let's go, Veronica. What was I calling her? It wouldn't have been Vanessa, right? That seems too silly. Some other V name that I just don't know. I don't know. Anyways, uh, hopefully she's near me. Looks like she's not. We're gonna go into this. Wait, what? Where the hell does this want me to go? It sounds like it wants me to go into these caves. Great, co okay. Does it want me to go in here? Yeah, uh, I don't know. There seems to be another exit. 
Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. This one's very weird, but obviously it's leading me over to all of these buildings, so we'll just- Oh my god. People, by the way, keep asking me why I don't use uh, iron sights. Um, it doesn't seem to be helping that much, in all honesty. Uh, it's just not... It doesn't really help the accuracy. Um, it it kind of like stilts my shot, if that makes sense. It makes it a little more stilted and hard to aim. Hard to aim. Uh, I don't know what the hell we're doing in here. I don't even know if this is for the quest. But I'm going to assume that it is. So we'll just explore a little bit. We'll also turn on our Pip-Boy light, because I always remember to do that. I'm really good at that, aren't I? Uh, we've got some great... Con oh, wow. Got some great con attack in the NCR, it looks like. Uh, some little wall murals there, in fact, which would make an excellent thumbnail. Uh, let's put our weapon away. Let's crouch. Let's get a nice little angle on that one. There we go. It's going to be a little hard to get the lighting there, but we'll make it work. God, those menus are so laggy. Um, okay, what do we have over this way? Great Con Supply Cache? Sounds like that's a quest to me. Bobby Pin, Frag Grenade. Uh, that's all we want there. We got a Hydra. We got a Lock Box. Let's try the Force Lock. Wow, I am so unlucky. I can't believe that actually worked. Produce Sack. Banana Yucca? Somebody was saying I was saying this wrong, but I thought Yucca. I, I was saying that right. I was, wasn't I saying... Haven't I been saying Yucca? Uh, I don't know. Anyway, Steady. Um, we got a couple of whiskeys. Don't mind if I do. Carton of cigs. Uh, two weight, 40 value. Nah. Some gra frag grenades, though. Yes. Uh, fixer, turbo. Thank you. And, yeah. Uh, where the hell does this want me to go, man? Um, yeah, this is a dead end. Got what we came for, though. That great con supply cache. I bet that is a great con quest. I don't actually know. Oftentimes, I'm never able to do the great con stuff because... The game wants you to be mean to them all the time. Uh, and we are going to be mean to them, but not before we do their quest. Uh, where the hell are you telling me to go, video game? It's like over there, but there's no path up the mountains. So I must just be missing a path. I mean, it definitely does not want you to do this. In fact, yeah, it seems that there's an invisible wall. So what in the hell? video game. Where would you like me to go? We'll explore a little bit, and then I'll just cut, because, yeah, this doesn't seem as straightforward as I originally had thought. That's blocking our path. Maybe we can get past this mountain. And the quest is called Climb Every Mountain. I understand that, but, you know. Okay, here we go. Looks like this will be better. But, yeah, climbing mountains in Bethesda games. Uh, not the best. But, JV, this was made by Obsidian. Bro, stop. Stop. Yes, it is, but they're using the exact same engine in Fallout 2, or Fallout uh, 3, sorry. Um, okay, I don't know where. Let's just go up here. Hopefully, Veronica can take care of those geckos. Oh, here we go. Okay. Great console. Yeah, so it's like, it's all one big cave, it looks like, but this is definitely the one I it wanted me to much. enter. You worry too much? <laughs> Try, try worrying as much as I've been worrying uh, with all this stuff going on in my personal life lately. Uh, nothing too serious. Nothing too serious. Basically, just... Who are you? How did you find this place? Hi there. Uh, basically, just comes down to a groin injury that refuses to heal and makes sitting incredibly uh, annoying and difficult and uncomfortable. Are you the one who's been raiding the refugee camp at Bitter Springs? Refugee camp? Is that what they're calling it? Good old NCR. They can whitewash anything. Let me tell you something. That refugee camp, it's built on the blood and tears of my people. Nobody likes to talk about it, but I remember. The people at this camp aren't responsible for your family's death. They're refugees. I know that, but what else can I do? Yeah, we're not going to tell him to go attack other people. The Khan settled in Red Rock Canyon years ago. It's time to let go of your hate and join them. Maybe. Maybe you're right. Maybe three years is vengeance enough. Thank you for helping me see that. Here, this will unlock the supply caches we left in caves around these mountains. We might get some use out of them. Um, yeah. This guy is a straight-up murderer, though. So I'm not really too happy about him just kind of, like, living. Like, it's pretty much confirmed that he has just been straight-up murdering innocent people. Right? Just on the basis of revenge. 
Uh, you know, but GV, uh, what happened to his people? Yeah, okay, so, yeah, violence doesn't beget vi- This weighs 10? There's another supply cache. Are we supposed to, like, open it? Oh, bring the supplies back. Oh, neat! Okay, so it's like two quests in one. I see. Pip boy light. Yeah, I have to remember that. I am. A I apologize to everybody that can't ever see stuff. Uh, just remember, I see it fine. YouTube decompress. You know, YouTube compresses it and makes it harder to see, and I'm always unaware of that. Um. Okay. So I guess we're done here. Then we got some ammunition boxes. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, we can rest to miss out on the to restore the little bit of health that we're missing out on. Okay, uh, unless we have to go get the other boxes, I won't worry about it. And I also think that um, it's probably a quest item, considering that it's they weigh like 20 pounds, and yet we're still not over encumbered. But that's really good. Now we know that we have the uh, that those are for the quest that we were doing, anyways. Uh, did we go this way? Yeah, we sure did. All right, let's go, Veronica. Did I turn my Pip-Boy light off? Why did I do that? Turn it back on. Yeah, I'm glad I'm not playing a stealth player, uh, stealth character, so we can actually use that Pip-Boy light. Yeah, so aiming down the sights, it does make it a little bit better, but honestly, hit firing is fine. I don't know. It's just like my go-to. I don't know why. Um, okay. So, should we just go back and turn that stuff in? I guess so. We'll knock out two birds with one stone, right? Although, we could do the other thing. Ooh! Okay. Can you stop? You're blocking my level up, jerk. And I think there's one more, too. Where are you at? Bye-bye. See, hip firing works just fine. Level 18. Okay, so uh, we're gonna be unlocking stuff here. Let's see, speech done, science done, lockpick done, energy weapons all the way up, son. Now what do we got at the bottom here? Computer whiz. Fail a hack attempt and get locked out of a computer. Not if you're a computer whiz with this perk. You can attempt to rehack any computer you were previously locked out of. Garbage. Just don't ever get locked out of a computer. The only time you want to take this perk is if you're new to any Fallout game and you get locked out and you want to go back and try it again. Otherwise, this is useless. Weapon strength requirements are now two points lower than normal for you. I think this would be really good. Because, yeah, we're not really going to be really taking strength. Also, somebody mentioned that this perk here in Shining Armor doesn't work. So, I guess that's true. I'm just going to assume that's true. I don't actually know. You know what? We are going to take uh, this. Uh, a lot of people have been saying, GB, why don't you take the, you know, the perks that uh, make you really, really strong? Because this game's easy, man. And I want to I wanna take the more interesting stuff. So, we're going to take this so we can use more interesting weapons later on down the line. And not have to worry about that perk ever again. That is why, in a nutshell. Might even help with the weapons we're using now. I don't actually know. Uh, we'll see. But like this big uh, plasma rifle. I don't know. It might even help with that. Make us be more accurate. Who knows? But later on down the line, I probably want to use some uh, more interesting stuff that's going to be much bigger. You know what I mean? So. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're going to turn these two things in. I think this uh, particular quest still has a component to it. So we're going to have to do something else. But uh, we'll see. Maybe this just flat out. What the hell was that? Maybe this just flat out ends it. We shall see, won't we? And yeah, there are only three quests for this place as far as I can tell. Did a little bit of research and I don't think there's anything else here. Not even miscellaneous stuff. So we should be able to clean out Bitter Springs absolutely complete, uh, completely. Which will be a good thing. It's a good thing. Okay, get your ass up. Salesman Weekly. Why are you reading that, by the way? You're back. Any progress on saving our skins? I found these supply caches in some caves up the mountain. Maybe they'll help. Where did you get this? You know what? It doesn't even matter. Thank you. This will be a tremendous help. <laughs> she said, where'd you get these, not this? <laughs> uh, okay, gain karma. Very nice. Bring the supplies back to Captain Giles. Done. I've dealt with the attacks on the camp. They won't be a problem anymore. You did? Who was it? Any information you could give me would be a big help for my reports. It was a great con raider. He had a base camp in a cave up the mountains. Really? Well, this canyon used to be a great con stronghold. I suppose that explains why he was able to evade us so easily. 
Any idea why a great con would be so far from Red Rock Canyon? About three years ago, NCR's first recon launched an attack on the con encampment here. There was a communication mix-up that resulted in some non-combatants being killed. I guess he was still bitter about it. It was a tragic mistake, but we've done all we can to make amends. Bitter like bitter springs? Hee 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 hee, tee hee hee hee. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's not very noble of them. It was actually a slaughter. Well, it's taken care of now. I convinced him to leave Bitter Springs alone. All right, what about that voice? See, like, in my head, my voices differ a little more than I think people actually hear. But, like, this is my normal voice. Uh, and then, like, you know, well, it's taken care of now. I convinced him to leave Bitter Springs alone. Like, what about that voice? It's got a little bit of rasp to it. I like it. I don't know. Anyways. I don't know how you did it, but thank you. What can I do to help? At this point, I'll take any... Yeah, we already know that. Okay, goodbye. All right, so let's see. What else do we have to do for? I think it's like one more thing. Yeah, we got this infirmary one, and then we got this. Wait, what? We can still do birds of a... That might be glitched, actually. Okay, uh, talk to Camp Forlorn Hope about reassigning soldiers to Bitter Springs. To oh, this was the one that can mess up. I see, yeah. Uh, talk to Camp McCarran. Talk to Camp Golf. So, let's go to... Uh, we haven't been to Forlorn Hope yet, and we have been to Camp Golf, to which we are liked. We're gonna go over this way first and foremost. Hope that we don't mess anything up. I don't know, man. It's just messing up things left and right in this game. Alright, I'm gonna stop saying that. I say that too much. I say it too much, don't I? Oh, another thing I've been getting a lot is, like, my voice sounds higher pitched. I think it's literally because I'm just putting more energy into my videos. Uh, you know, before, hey. like, in my, go look at my first video ever. It's like, hi, my name's Grove oh, Man. Hell. What is it now? Hi, my name's Grovana. Welcome to a Halo uh, 4 guide on how to get the most experience. You know, I, it's just putting more enthusiasm into my videos. I, I don't know. Captain Giles at Bitter Springs needs reinforcements. Can you spare any? Hey, you're a damn fine soldier, and word on the grapevine is that you're already some kind of hero. You got yourself a deal. Damn, that worked out. Okay, goodbye. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> All right, see you later. Um, okay, that was easy. Oh, by the way, everybody thinks I'm going to go NCR because, like, we've just been doing NCR stuff and it's been working out. Yeah, uh, hold your horses, okay? I didn't say we're going NCR, so just relax. And we could still go NCR. I'm not saying we're not. I'm just saying, I, trust me, I'm not saying we're going to go NCR. Or that's not the end goal right now. It's not, so. Relax. We're not going one place or the other. Everybody seems to know about this playthrough. Like, they know exactly where I'm going to go, what I'm going to do. Just be patient, please, please. Okay, uh, let's see. It sounds like we need to go to Colonel Shu, I guess. Uh, whoever is the big deal at uh, Camp McCarran here. Uh, last chance, Veronica, by the way, if you want to do your dialogue. That'd be nice. Otherwise, traveling with you is completely worthless. You're just making the playthrough worse because you're just too good at pummeling people. Like, you could talk to me right now if you want. But, of course not. Okay, hi. We're all impressed with the work you've done for us. Thought you might be able to make use of this. It's a key to a little hideaway south of here. We've used it as a place for rangers to rest and resupply. I thought you might get good use out of it. Thanks, bud. We got the NCR safe house key. Um... Captain Giles of Bitter Springs needs reinforcements. Can you spare any? Well, you have been a great help here, and with the saboteur dealt with. Yes, I think we can spare a few men. Consider it done. So there we go, easy. Just make sure to do some of the stuff here before, you know, getting good with the uh, NCR, and you'll find this quest quite easy. I didn't plan that. So many things in this playthrough have been going quite well, I gotta say, and uh, barely any of it is planned, I promise. Camp Forlorn Hope, sounds like we're going to Nelson. Okay, let's do that. I know the Bitter Springs quests aren't that interesting, by the way, but uh, just want to get them out of the way now in order to not have them uh, coincide with some later stuff. I don't, I think we would be fine regardless, but, you know, just got to be careful. Got to err on the side of caution. Now, that's why I kind of took issue with people saying that they wish that I had researched more uh, before doing these episodes. I, as I said, I mean, I did so much. I have a gigantic note f notepad file. Okay. 
I have a gigantic notepad file that I really took a lot of time to research and make sure, you know, to let me know. If it isn't the courier who's done everything he can to defy the will of mighty Kaisar, the Legion holds Nelson profligate. This is where you'll die. Brothers, attack! What the hell? Nice one, bud. Really worked out in your favor now, didn't it? Take your money. Thanks so much. I'll take that. You can have your spears. Whoa. Oh, my God. Veronica is a one-woman punching machine. Veronica, you are absolutely not so. Uh, I, I know, but GV, you just complained about her. I know, but I'm saying she's just too good. That's my point. Um, okay. We're going to go over this way. Uh, we only got 13 shots left for this thing, so we got to be a little bit careful here, but we should be fine. Uh, we do need to start stocking up on some backup weapons, though. Uh, it has turned out that energy weapon ammo isn't as common as I may have thought it would have been. How did she manage that one? Did she punch him with telekinesis? Neat. I don't uh, remember this many random-ass landmines being all over the place, but we sure are finding all of them, aren't we? All right, so we need to go to Camp Forlorn Hope, which seems to be right up here where these uh, NPCs are. This is the only one, uh, only one that I'm a little worried about not working out, but it should be fine, hopefully. Hi there. Okay. So here's Camp Forlorn Hope. Don't know what the word forlorn means, by the way. Usually I'm pretty proud of my etymology and lexicon and grammar, but uh, I don't... Yeah, I don't know what forlorn means for somebody. I know it's an adjective. Morning. Somebody is forlorn. I'll have to look that one up. Um... Where are we going? Somebody's like on the outskirts over here. I would assume there's quests here, by the way. I'm not sure what those would be. Uh, we might actually see here since we're going to the command center. Probably be able to convince him though. Hello. I'm glad to see you here. We could definitely use your help. Captain Giles of Bitter Springs needs reinforcements. Can you spare any? I'll be honest. The Legion has me worried here, but I think I can spare some soldiers. Consider your request granted. Goodbye. Watch yourself out there. So yeah, there's definitely a quest here too. We'll get that later on. I don't want to do just a whole bunch of NCR stuff because it's just, man, the NCR is so needy, aren't they? Back to Bitter Springs. Looks like we're done with this one. We're done with the mountain one. Kind of weird that they called the mountain one its own quest considering it's literally just walk in, talk to the guy, and that's it. But, you know. Hey. Uh, so we'll do this one and then we'll, ooh, this looks bright, uh, vibrant and saturated. I like it a lot. This guy's limping. Good luck, man. Good luck. You can do it. Trust in, trust in yourself. Okay. Uh, so this quest is done. And we got one more to do for Bitter Springs. And we'll be good to go. I don't remember anything about where the books are. Or where to find them. He said talk to caravanners. So we'll do that. Um, but yeah, these quests haven't been too interesting. The man in the, in the mountain was cool, though. That was the most interesting thing thus far. Oh, I've heard of you. What do you want? You've heard of me? We literally have had conversations multiple times. Are things going better at the camp now? Thanks to your help, I think Bitter Springs has a real shot at surviving. I can't offer much of a reward, but know that the NCR is very grateful. Thank you. Five out of five quests complete for quest and mark or whatever. NCR fame gained. Quest completed. No, no, not much. We're getting so much NCR fame, and I promise you that wasn't the plan. But uh, to, to front load all the NCR stuff, but... I don't need any reward. Just keep these people fed and healthy. That's very generous of you. I appreciate it. Yeah, I mean, trust me, rewards are good, but I mainly need energy weapon ammo, and you're probably not going to give me that, so. It's all good, man. By the way, Bre uh, Better Call Saul is a very good show. I originally had rid it off as just going to be a lesser Breaking Bad. Uh, it's not. It's actually, uh, it's it's really its own thing, and it's really, really good. And uh, I think I've seen all of it, unless there's a new season out that I haven't watched yet. Uh, highly recommend it if you're if you like uh, Breaking Bad. And yes, I will be watching the Breaking Bad movie coming up. Gonna watch it with my girlfriend. We're both big fans of Breaking Bad, and I think personally, Breaking Bad is literally the best show ever made. Is it my favorite show of all time? No, but I think it's the best show ever made. Uh, what are we doing here? Okay, guess we're going back out. Uh, can you all stop running? Around? Hello, sir. What? Man, he's just running for. Can you wait? If you're looking to buy or sell, you've come to the right man. The Crimson Caravan Company has the widest selection in the wasteland. Show me what you have for sale. Can do. 
Uh, what are we look? Oh yeah, we're looking for the. Um, okay, we're looking for some book. Tales of Chivalry, not that book. Oh, I never noticed that little AE thing. I don't know what you call that. Um, all right, it's probably miscellaneous if we have to buy it out right here. I don't know if he's gonna have it though. Are we just supposed to buy it? Stress and the Modern Refugee, a primer. Sounds like what that is to me. Uh, also, no sensor module. These people just never have that. It's crazy. Uh, tiny, tiny babies. All you need to know about pedi pediatric medicine. Okay, that was easy. Sweet. Thanks. Man, I didn't expect to get all three of these quests done in one episode, but there you go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, now they put us down here at the bottom, so every time we have to do the big walk up, but that's okay. What do you think about that? I can't believe it. Caesar Shut it! In attacks in force and I actually survived. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah, you survived because of me and Boone, trust me, not because of your own volition. Y'all are probably useless doing nothing. But don't worry, I uh, come to expect that. Uh, this being a video game and NPCs and all AI being completely freaking useless all the time. That's okay. God, I want to do a video like top 10 actual useful NPCs. What would they be? Elizabeth and Bioshock Infinite springs to mind. Hi. Those medical supplies have already been a phenomenal help. Thank you. No problem, crop top. Wait, that's not a crop. I don't know what you call that hairdo. Um, I found those books you wanted. Both of them? Wow, that's very resourceful. Thank you. I think that should just about cover us. I really don't know how to thank you. You're bringing me these supplies saved a lot of people. Don't sweat it. I was glad to help. Well, still, thanks again. Okay. God, this voice actor, they use him for everything. <laughs> I notice him in, like, every single character now. Yeah. All right, so that's all the Bitter Springs quest done, folks. I don't think there's literally anything else to do here other than, you know, maybe look for unique weapons or whatever, or if there's any other stuff hiding, if we have to come back to get certain things or anything like that. But that should be it, folks. Uh, I'm glad we got all three done in the same episode because, yeah, they're not the most interesting, let's be honest. But we have to do them because, hey, what is this? Oh, is it a 100% series? Oh, that's right. It is a 100% series. Wow, neat. Uh, we, I might look into finding the other triggers for Veronica and getting that done with. I really don't like having this companion around when she's, use, uh, again, not useless, but, you know, I don't want companions. So if she's not going to trigger her stuff, then there's no point having her. So I'll try to find the other ones and see. Uh, we'll grab this ranger station to end the episode. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for supporting me on Patreon or liking the videos or sharing the videos or commenting on the videos. All that stuff helps me out. Disabling ad, uh, ad blocker, everything like that uh, is the way that I can continue to do this full time. Um, and I really, really, really do appreciate it. I, I promise you. I mean, trust me. I'd love to continue doing this for forever. And, you know, the only way is if uh, I make ad revenue, to put it shortly. So I'm trying my best with this series. And I really do appreciate the people helping me on Patreon and also... Um, just by uh, watching the video and having ads turned on. It's not all about that, but it helps me to do this as a living, so thank you. All right, thanks so much for watching, everybody, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye!